my name is Jaden, and today I will show you how to draw Captain Underpants. The first thing that you will need is a, a pencil or a pen. Beginners, I suggest a pencil. A, 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 red, a red utensil, Micro suggested. A peach colored utensil, Micro Crayon suggested. And a brown utensil, my, again, colored pencil suggested. The first thing that you will do is draw an egg-shaped cat. And you, and you should put your paper landscape. Okay. Like, like this. Even though this is not my best, but somewhere like this. Now just draw one little eyebrow at the top. Draw one line underneath it and one line on the other side. These will be the eyes. And now you're going to draw almost a pig nose. Just watch and learn. Like this. And now you will draw a big white not just a happy face a big white thing like this and draw a line across just like this and if you want it to look really good if you want it to look really good color Color in the mouth. I'm going to finish coloring it in. Color in the mouth like this. Now it's moving on to the cape. You're going to make a very oval shaped thing at the corner of his body and draw a, line, a small little line. Now draw a circle right next to it, and two lines coming out from it like that. Draw, draw a long thing and stretch like this, make almost a V-shape. And then by closing it in, you're not gonna do spikes, but more rounded, <laughs> like this. Like this, almost like a gigantic hand. And then you're gonna draw a very for the body. You're gonna draw a very round body. Close it. Now you will draw a most U shaped, and I did mine way too short. You should do yours a lot bigger. Draw, draw lines going a small little lines going across the underwear and draw two lines coming out from that line if from one perspective you would put you would put the line over here and draw a foot coming out. Pretty good then. Even though if it's not the way you draw toes, this is how it looks. And then draw it on the other side. If you want, you can maybe add a little 
maybe you can add a little like knee bump. Look. This. And then for the building. The building gets kind of tricky. Do a V shape at the bottom. Um, maybe make it a little wider, draw one, draw it touching his leg, then draw the other side, and there you go, almost like a baseball field. Draw two lines coming out from the side. And if you want, make windows. Then they're just tiny little squares. At least that's how, at least that's how the person who draws Captain Underpants draws it. So. Sometimes it takes a long time, so... And now we're going to draw the arms. I like to have him put his, the hands on his hips. So it will be like that. And maybe, and for the hands, almost like a flower shaped. Like this. Like this. And then just do it on the other side if you want his hands to be on his hips. Just do the same thing as the first one. And let me think, oh yes, his ears. Draw them very low and just two very small bumps. If you want, you can put a line in it. I normally don't, but I will. Um, let me see, what am I missing? Oh yes, the dots for the cape. Just make dots, just make dots on the cape because, yeah, just make dots on the cape, all, the whole cape. Like this, and if you're, and if the arm kind of backed into the cape, don't worry. When you color it in, it'll be okay. Just make sure not to put the dots on the arm because then that will make a difference. Okay, moving on to the color. You you need your red pen and color in the cape. Don't color in the arm. Okay, well you get the point. This is not my best draw coloring, but sometimes the dots don't show through. Then just retrace the dots. Um, and now your peach crayon comes in handy. Use it to color in the arm, even the arm that may have covered the cape, the belly. Be sure not to color in the underwear. The face, I won't color in the whole face, but you get, you get the idea. 
and and the legs. And then finally, use the brown crayon to color in your building. And again, this will not be my most perfect coloring, but we just need to make this quick and simple, so I'll color in most of it, but... And, and don't color in that, and... And if you want, you can make lines coming out, and this is what it will look like when it's finished. Happy drawing!